Come see what's happening at Maui's newest dealership, Jim Falk Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram, located at 195 Putunani Avenue, and the cars and trucks are in stock and ready for delivery. Aloha everyone, it's Kiora Balul with Maui Now. Last we spoke with Chef Beverly Gannon. She had shut the doors on her restaurant Joe's in Wailea after a business partnership fell through. That was in 2015. Now in 2016, she's found a way to keep the spirit of Joe's alive at its sister restaurant, Gannon's in Wailea. People would come in here and, and then to Holy Miley going, what happened to Joe's? I really kind of soul searched about do I reopen it? Do I not? And with having Gannon's, and Gannon's being such a large operation, um, we all got together and talked about it, and I went, I'm just going to bring Joe's menu items that everybody loved to Gannon's. You know, you still have a great view. Um, we just put all Joe's gold records back up and his pictures and his memorabilia here. And so we actually, people are starting to come in for the meatloaf and the chocolate bread pudding and the prime rib. And so basically it's like having two restaurants in one place. The shape farm? The ahi carpaccio. It's a huge seller. It was my husband's favorite thing at Joe's, you know, and it's back here. And we see those going out all day long. Well, at Gannon's, we created this incredibly awesome ahi poke. I think we sell about 30 to 40 a day. We serve with taro chips. We make these in the house. And avocado in it, and it's just so good. So for me, that's kind of, well, here's your choice. You can have the kind of down home, and then you can have the a little more refined. The same as we have Joe's Meatloaf here. Joe likes lots of barbecue sauce on Joe's Meatloaf. Which is just your good old down home, great tasting meatloaf. But we also have, I mean, if you like steak, I have found bar none the best steak that I ever want to eat. I can't go back. This is it. I like to sear it around the outside. It's a Wagyu Kobe Snake River Farms. Um, melts in your mouth steak. Well, first of all, look at the size of this thing come up. They grow up country. I have a secret garden up country that at some point I will be able to reveal where my produce is coming from, but oh my God, the garden is spectacular. The watermelon radishes, so the inside of them are like that bright, bright uh, red. A couple of times a week, we get the most beautiful carrots and potatoes and scallions and leeks and fennel and beets. On that salad. It's being grown all organically. I mean, hands down, the quality is by far, you know, it's not sitting in a box on a barge or flying over lettuces and, and it, you know, actually looks alive. And I, I know that the guests definitely, you know, know the difference between what's on the plate and what they're getting at other restaurants. Kind of the restaurant of my dreams. And it really became that. I mean, I remember the night before we opened, almost six and a half years ago now, um, standing at the back of the dining room and looking forward and getting chills and going, oh my God, this is so beautiful. You know, the red bar. I just had this vision of having a bar that was totally red. So you have lilac oil, you have lihi moi around the rim, and then you have jalapeno syrup. You know, the view here, I think we do get 180 ocean views, and you're able to see all the way from McKenna, all the way over to Lanai and, you know, Kahalabe. For me, it's just like, you know, if I can just keep the food level as high as I can, you know, it would be an impeccable experience, I think, for any guest that sits down. It's a pretty special spot. And it's not that far, from, you know, it's five minutes from the nearest hotel in Wailea. Everybody needs to remember that. It's close. Gannon's is known to have one of the best and longest happy hours on the island, and you will find some of those Joe's favorites on the menu for happy hour as well. You can learn more in my article on MauiNow.com. I'm Kiora Balul for Maui Now. Mahalo for watching.